See what we mean. We're a drum band, and we have dancers. And I know that a lot of you guys are from Moon Dance, right? Is this part of Moon Dance? This is the part of the Moon Dance. Okay, Matoto is part of Moon Dance. This is a, a manifestation. That's right. It's an image. It's an image. You catching all this? We're, we're getting it all together. Anyway, the name of the band is Matoto. Let's give it up for them and get on with the afternoon.
I should always talk before we dance. <laughs> Thank you all for coming on this beautiful Saturday afternoon to share with us some rhythms and dances from Guinea in West Africa. And I'd like to take just a moment, Long John touched on it, but we're calling ourselves Matodo so that I have this great opportunity to tell you a little bit about a nonprofit that we're part of. So when Byron and I first went to Guinea to study the rhythms of West Africa, to study these drum rhythms and dances, we experienced such generosity in the sharing that we said, how can we give back? What can our exchange be? And our dear friend Jikla said, how about a school? And it's history from there. There's um, two blocks of classrooms. There's so, so very much going on in the village now. Um, and it all came from this music, essentially, from the power of sharing the arts together and from Jigla's simple request. So Matodo Multicultural Arts Society, please Google it later. And, uh, and many thanks to Alia Jigla Sila and Balai Samato.
right, so we're just going to switch the drums around a little bit here. So I'll just introduce our fabulous crew. My name's Lynn. This is Byron in the hat. Hey! Brian on the dunes in the front. Chris, right behind him. This is Nika and Liz and Michael. And we've got Zena and Jocelyn maybe waving from the side. Oh, there they are. <laughs> when you're not familiar with the rhythms it can all sound kind of similar a lot of noise more more music less banging <laughs> is what we want to try to highlight so we're gonna actually come into this rhythm called Lamban one drum at a time so that you can get a sense of the polyrhythm and of how the parts fit together because really each drummer is playing a relatively simple part but it's in the complexity of layering them together that we get the music. It's truly community-based music in that sense. It would not sound like much if there was only one drummer up here. So, so you'll hear the dun dun, the big bass drum come in, and then listen for the conversation that it has with the sangba, and then the kinkini, and then the djembe's will kick in after that. So see if you can pick out each individual part and hear how they're interacting with each other. That's why I don't give him the microphone. <laughs> so we're going to do a song now. It's a call and response. It's the same line for both. We're going to do it women against men. And I encouraged... <laughs> no, it's not a contest. Um, and so I encourage you to join in as well. It's just the one line back and forth. So uh, you'll be able to catch it. And it doesn't matter if you're saying it exactly right or not. It's a party song. We're calling out to the next, the next village saying, come on over. We're having a good time over here.
So is everyone feeling the love today? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Nice, because at the end of the day, that's what it's all about. You know, at the end of our adventurous, uh, dynamic lives, you know, we look back on everything and, and you know, we think about what's important to us. And, uh, you know, sum it up in one word. You all know what that word is. So live it, love it, and be it. The next song's uh, called the Dune Dance. We let the drummer or the dancers drum this time. See how they do.
So if you think this looks like fun, it is. So now you get a chance to try. We're gonna play a rhythm called Jolé, and I'll invite everyone up. Do your own free dancing if you like, or we'll lead you through just a couple really simple steps.
just gonna say this is our last piece and so I encourage you if you'd like to keep dancing please feel welcome we'll be taking up you know a fair bit of the space but there's lots of other space you can keep grooving with us thank you again so much for coming Matoto Multicultural Arts Society it was a pleasure to be here with you today That was just a whole bunch of fun. A total. Moonshine Studios. Moon Dance. Dynamic Art School down in Shawnigan Lake, I think it is, Cobble Hill. But what a, 
very exhilarating. Glad to see so many people love dancing. Even if you were sitting in your chairs, I could see you dancing. Those little movements that go on. Almost like a folk festival, like the Islands Folk Fest, which is taking place this weekend. Still tickets available for tonight's show. Runs right through to midnight. You catch, what's that? Anyway, they're on tonight. It's the 32nd annual. All started around the campground. Campfire, and a major part of it the uh, improvements that the uh, province farm. They've been helping out working together with that society, two societies, upgrading the stage, improving the beer gardens, doing most of the all those things. All sorts of things and working together. Congratulations. Thank you. 